this Saudi took his wife and off and flicked them at his brother Nathan. He said, are you ready to make that record? They had moved to Sheffield to get away from smack. Build a studio and continue the struggle. But the zip on Nathan's Fred Perry tracksuit was broken, so he couldn't take it off. If he wasn't family, Leas would have fired him from the fat white family. A dog race and a mango lassie first burped the younger brother, as though some secret code had been broken. If smiling and farting were sports, he'd have the world record. But under the beret, his mind was in constant struggle against reason, what he called psychological smack. Saul Adamczewski flew back from New York with an arse full of smack and begged to be let back into the fat white family. I, I took our Alaska, he screamed through the letterbox. My, My struggle. struggle! In truth, Leas was just a pub singer without his brother Saul, and he had no idea how to make a record. But Saul went on strike in Paris, and their bond was broken. Back in London, Joe Pancucci's heart had been broken, although to his credit, he did not resort to smack. So he was chosen by default to rejoin for the third record and try to make it sound more like the Partridge family. He was doing press-ups when he heard Saul yelling, Brother Joe, let me in. I've come to save you from your struggle. It was the first time he'd spoken to Joe since the tour of struggle. After the punch, he was lucky his nose wasn't broken. In the metros, he had treated Joe like a stepbrother. Still, no answer. Saul fetched from his arse a condom of smoke and went to a phone box to smoke it while he called his family. Dad, he cried, they they don't don't want me on the new record. record. So it was Nathan's turn to try and produce the record. But his dependence on ketamine made it a struggle to sound like his favourite band, The Lighthouse Family. He couldn't even use the bongo because it was broken. So he had Adam bend over and gave his arse a smack. Leas had never been so proud of his brother. So they named the record Songs for Our Brothers by the Fat White Family. Best played on a broken stereo. If it's still a struggle, try listening to it on smack. (laughs) 